My poor little Bobby is sick. She, so for the past couple weeks, she's been having just a little bit of congestion on and off, nothing too bad. We can usually like clear it pretty easily with going in like a steamy shower, but last night after we put her down, she started breathing like, sounded like she was having trouble breathing. Even earlier in the day yesterday, Chris said she only took an ounce um, out of the bottle when he fed her the first time and I don't know if that's related or not but so yeah she was like like having that like really congestion -y sound it sounded like it was she was having some trouble breathing we called her pediatrician's um, like overnight phone service thing and talked to the nurse or Chris did he talked to her for quite a bit um, and she even like listened to her breathing over the phone and said because it sounds pretty nasally we don't need to take her in like right away just take her in to the office like this morning um but she did say we need to keep an eye on her all night so we kind of like took turns watching her all night i mean chris actually did most of it because i'm supposed to be to work uh today but i'm going in late because i don't want to like leave her while she's not feeling good i mean i know chris could handle it but She's so young, I can't, I can't just like leave my little baby, but. What kind of surprised me though, is that even though she's not feeling well, she slept like super, super hard. I mean, she would kind of wake up here and there from having some trouble breathing, I guess, but it wasn't all the way wake up. It was just like a kind of move around thing. Um, even now she's it's like, nine and she's still sleeping poor little thing yeah we were passing her back and forth between the rock and play and her bassinet like depending on which one of us was watching her you not feeling well my little girl she actually doesn't sound that bad right now Last night, it was getting kind of rough. Oh, sucks, because I'm going to have to wake her up to get her in the car seat. <laughs> Poor baby. Don't be sick. Don't be sick, I love you. Poor thing. You can tell she's not feeling well. She's usually in a really good mood in the morning, and this morning when I wanted to change her, she was really upset. She said, I don't like being stoppy. Nose clear out. Chris just said, thank you for going with me today. And I was like, um, this is more for me than it is for you. <laughs> said, I can't leave this precious little baby. Not when she's not feeling well. I can't even stand it. I can't stand leaving a baby. <laughs> yeah. I can't leave my baby. Oh. She was actually just smiling a minute ago. Because she's a big girl. Smiling when she's sick. All right, baby, we're gonna get you feeling better. Poor little baby. Doc says it's just a cold. So that's a pretty big relief. Um, she listened and said that her lungs sound really good. You know, it's just like a lot of nasal, nasal congestion and we should just keep trying to like suction it out and do humidifiers and steam and all that stuff. Um, she basically just said as long as she's not running a fever that just kind of like we let it run its course um, which she hasn't she hasn't been running a fever at all so that's good mm. so it could take like a week and a half to two weeks to go away so I feel so bad for my poor little girl being sick but I'm really happy that it's just a cold with it being like 
the middle of the winter and the fact that I'm like working in a nursing home and exposed to all kinds of bugs every day like made me a little bit nervous but just a little baby cold I'm so sorry you had to experience a cold so early in your life little girl but I actually uh, I'm not gonna go to work today I'm gonna just go on Monday for a few hours to kind of catch up from what I'm missing from today and yeah we're just gonna snuggle and cuddle and suction your nose out oh the doctor did a lot better job suctioning her than I do she actually got it up there and really got snot out which I usually don't but poor little girl was screaming whenever she was doing it I felt bad for her but it worked and her nose was clear for a couple hours. But is it like noon now? So yeah. It is starting to sound a little more congested. But I guess I'll just have to suction her out. Poor baby. Do you want to eat? Okay, I'll feed you. Hey. Uh-oh. Hey, sorry. Did you get it out? Me and Bobby just sat in a steamy bathroom. And then I sucked her little nose out with the nose Frida. Yeah. <laughs> and it worked pretty well this time. Her breathing sounds pretty good. She got a little bit of a wet diaper, which is a good thing. So I'm about to go change. Make my baby better. Make my baby better. Oh, sweet girl. Bless you, baby. Get all those boogies out your nose. Get all those boogies out your nose. Okay, let's go change ya. I bet you're gonna poop as soon as you get a clean diaper on. Is that what you're gonna do? He said, no, not me. I don't ever do that. No, I never do that. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm procrastinating. I just want you to poop now if you're going to. Poor thing. Poor sick little girl. We are enjoying another steamy bathroom. <laughs> I'm gonna try, see if I can't suck some more of that swallow. No luck with the suck. The only way I've really been able to get any snot out of her is if I put that saline in first, but she really hates that. So I was hoping that steaming it out would help. Hey Bobby, how you feeling? You feeling any better? So not really, not really that much better, but I'm a big girl, I can handle it. Cute little girl. So I feel better, Bobs.